Hello everyone, welcome back to another video on my channel. Today, I'm going to take you guys around our house and where we stay. So my wife just traveled and I've been so bored in the house, so I'm like, yeah, let me take you guys around. So before I take you guys around, I have to go outside to show you a view of the house. So first of all, let's go outside. So I have to give you all a quick history about this house and of course all the houses in our neighborhood and uh, to interest you to know that all the houses around this neighborhood were built in the 60s. Our own specifically was built in 1965. So this is our neighborhood, it's a really 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 nice neighborhood really really nice neighborhood and then this is our house this, there is the front door from the uh, that's where we do our laundry wash our clothes that's the master's bedroom where we sleep that's uh, my wife's office and this one is my own room aka my office that's uh, dining window so we normally do not use this door. The house has three entrance. So I we like to use this one. Why? Because this is our driveway that leads to the garage. So there's no need of you know coming back and going to the front. So we use this door over here. The house has three entrance and it is 1687 square feet and it has this big lawn. I don't know, I didn't know what to do with this. Of course, the leaves from this tree fell down. So don't hear me. I'm gonna burn it. I know my wife will say, burn this, burn this, but I'm gonna do it. So yeah. We I decided to turn this place into a garden. Also, I look at this place to a garden and also a garden. So I plant everything from what to leave, pepe to okra and everything I could I could see. Um this is a view of how the back of the house looks like. As you can see, it's really, really an old, cute house. And this is how all the houses around this neighborhood looks like. So, at the back we have an entrance here, and that window leads to the toilet that we set aside for the guests, and my wife uses it all the time. And that's the window to a toilet that leads to the master's bedroom that's my wife's bedroom up and that's our main bathroom that we use so let's get inside so since we're going through the back door this is it and then once you get inside you have an inner picture of how the house looks like this is all my shoes because I'm walking. My wife walks from home, so I have to display them here. And this is the sitting room. We have three couch. We have two couch and one recliner. So I will sit down here to watch the movie. The news is on now. And then I didn't know how or what to decorate the house with, so we just decided to use this. It's pretty much new to us. Um, this is a drawing that we did. My mother-in-law did that. I did this and my wife did this one. So tell me which picture is the best. What's the light are doing up there? Oh, I guess it's for the fireplace. Yeah, okay. So tell me which one is the best. And this one, my wife did this, did this one and I did this one. Tell me also which one is the best. And that was a gift. My wife did one and her friend did one. And then this is the almighty gift that I gave my wife a few days ago. I'll put the link in the description and up here if you want to watch so yeah that's how the sitting room looks like it's really spacious and nice so we have like white chairs that we displayed around the countertops and then up on the left we have this beautiful aquarium where we have some little fishes hey fish hey fishes E fishes, e fishes, e fishes. <laughs> and then we have the countertop has a sink inside where we wash plates, 
and stuff. And here we have our dishwasher. And then here we put our spicy salt, crayfish and stuff. Below we have oil and other things. Rack where we dry our, our plates, everything. This is an air fryer. And then this is where the magic happens, where we cook. And of course, baking things. So I decided to turn this into a gallery where I put all the pictures of me and my wife from the one when we met and the journey and everything so I decided to put the, 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 the person who built the house really did a good job in you know with the cabinet and making it look so cute so I was like huh, what am I going to do so yeah turned it into a gallery so this is a fridge that we have it's really scanty because my wife is not around so I have rice and stew, I have uh, yellow rice, and this should be, oh, my wife's best soup, banga soup, that is um, tama soup. And we have here jollof rice, and we have plantain, chicken, and then some hams and cheese, and bread. My wife is so funny, she decided to buy me banana bread because she said I love I love bread so much. So here is where we put our salad things and we have palm nut cream, concentrated palm nut cream that we use for a tama soup and then for coconut rice we use coconut milk. That is that. And that is that. So down here we have different type of soups. We have a fang soup. Uh, fish, stew, uh, periwinkle, uh, tama, stew, we have a tama here, stew, we have white soup, and some snail, shrimps, uh, what is this, mushroom, you know, that's all, so. Here is our deep freezer where we put our crayfish, fish, and everything that we bought, leaves that we brought from Nigeria. Everything are in here. In here we store our stuff like rice, beer, noodles, and what have you. So yeah, Gary is also there, but we decided to cut some into a container that is inside this small cabinet. Uh, we have Gary, rice, and pounded yam flour and some pots inside here. And up here we have spoons and chopping boards and stuff. So yeah, that's pretty much everything in the kitchen. Here we put some bags and food, spaghetti. We have some tea. I have my Milo. I have my middle, middle for drinking. And then here we stock some other, you know, stocks. Then we put some medicine here and my wife's tea, she loves drinking tea. So that's pretty much a feel about the house. This is a dining. As you can see, this is where we do our videos. And that's my lunchbox and my water bottle. This one I drink at night and it's pretty much. So where should we start first? Up or down? Right, let's go up. So when you climb up, you see my room first. Let's go to my room first. So this is my room, this is my desk, and this is the little uh, air foam that I have. If my wife wants to come and hang out with me, she comes here, sit down, plug her laptop over there and disturb me. That's where I put my daily clothes. That's where I put my dresses, underwear, more underwear, my gimbal, uh, stand for my camera, tripod, and my shelf, lights. This is where I paste a few things about, about my life, just to remind me about life. And then this other one as well. I have my wife's three top pictures that I love most. Here, my laptop. Keep my ring small pepper chair. I love it. I love it. 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 So 
and then lead to my wardrobe how about my clothes it's so funny that when i came here i thought that i would use all my traditional attire that i sewed but appears but so you need to wear something that can cover all the cold and make you warm so not for my room let's go over to my wife's office and so of course women your hat bag must be here so you have a laptop I don't want you guys to see what she wrote on the wall for work you have a printer stuff little lamp and then it's pretty much about the room stand for lights and then she have also her wardrobe as well here she has too many clothes so she had to create another wardrobe here in her office so that's it and then that leads me to her room and then have all her A products let me on the lights have all her A products lined up hampers for I don't know what she puts here but yeah I mean women's room you know the almighty closet that she puts all her clothes like it is too much too much this lady yeah, so that's her room. That's a feel around her own room. I don't know what drawing that is, but oh, that should be MJ Michael Jackson. So that is her room. She just scattered all these boxes inside. That's traditional dresses inside. So yeah, this is her room. So she has all these things. I don't know. I think I would know. We should put what and what. So let's try. Let me try. So I think she she puts panties and bra here. I think I can see it. This should be a bra. And then she puts shorts and I don't know. Let me try. Oh yeah, of course. She puts her bra here and her panties. <laughs> I was right. Come side before I'm caught. And then oh yeah shorts and shirts <laughs> I was right and then she also put other things here and other things here and other things so yeah this that's all for her room and leads you to a little closet where we put our towel and then some suitcases if we want to travel lead it to the toilets this is like the main bathroom that we use in our house let me hold the light and then we have this bath this shower curtain it is really really nice say an african lady with something on her head and yeah i like the bath i like the bathroom not really my first part you know i like i like shower than the top it, I, I get very really scary when I take my bath in the bathroom top I prefer a shower and standing shower so it has all these styles I love these styles the way it's displayed around the bathroom it's really really nice yeah so that's pretty much about the bathroom this is my toilet I only use this one well, I use two toilets in the house but she uses only one I take it to her own toilet and then it's a vanity where we brush my mouth sometimes. Yep, let's go downstairs. Oh my goodness. Okay, so that's where we do our video. Like I said before, that's the dining. So let's you downstairs to the basement. And then when you come downstairs, we have this should be the visitor's toilet, but my wife decided to turn into her own personal toilet, right? So this is the vanity, it's cute, vanity light, then she has her own toilet, of course, yeah, shut, shut toilet, and then from outside, from when you come out of the toilet, we have a closet that we turn into a warehouse where we put our tools like screwdrivers and anything, any repair tools. Closet lead it to the laundry room. This laundry room 
was one of the places in the house that felt very scary for me the first day I came. Like, I was so scared of this huge machine and how naked the room is. So this is a furnace system that controls the heating and cooling system in the house. And this big thing is <clears throat> the water heater. And so that's what we have in the laundry room. We also have a washing, our dryer, and then as well as the washing machine. And this big, we call it dusts, that takes a around the house, you know, cooling and heating. This pipe is for, I guess, the gas pipe because our heating system is gas. So, yeah, pretty much it's scary how people build houses here in the US. They use drywall to build their houses while we use concrete and uh, blocks. And they also uh, insulate their houses. As you can see, those things are insulations. And this is the dust that I was talking about takes the air around the house and our dryer is gas so that's a gas pipe to the dryer yep pretty much that's it all right enough about the cooling system this is this is our master's bedroom this is where we sleep on the lights this is where we sleep the wall is empty I've been thinking of putting something on this wall it's pretty much an empty wall so I've been thinking of putting up something. We only sleep here. We just we only come here in the night, so that's why it's really special and big. I sleep this side while she sleeps this side. So that's our teddy bear and the box containing all our hair. Don't get it, maybe I don't understand. Then this is the way we brush. I use Colgate. And she uses crests. I don't know if you and your wife or your partner uses the same uh, uh, toothpaste, but we use different, and it's very weird. That's hers, and that's mine. Um, so yeah, we have the, this is a half bathroom that I was telling you guys about. It's really, really small and nice. I love it. Except the water is. I don't know whoever said the water. It, it's always very cold. So toilets and here we put all our supplies cream washing hand things Clorox napkins and paper towel and of course her always <laughs> so it's not a big house but it's good enough for us to call home and I'm so so happy for everyone who choose to watch this video. Thank you so much for having to come into our house virtually and I hope that you like the video. Make sure you give me a thumbs up and let me know that you like and drop a comment. Tell me about the house, something that you saw that you liked and make sure you subscribe if you're new. And thank you, thank you, thank you so much for all the support and bye.